Well, hello there, it's Cream, and welcome to Tutorial Tuesday. No, it's neither Throwback Thursday nor Transformation Tuesday and other stuff like that. It's Tutorial Tuesday because here it's not Instagram, it's YouTube. And I'm going to teach you how to do custom beds. And what I mean by that, let's say it in, let's say it in an informational way. Are you bored of the standard beds of The Sims 4? Are you fed up with the lack of new beds in the game? No matter where you see and search, and how many rooms you find, they all look alike. You don't want to use custom content because it's just too hard. Then look no further because we have a solution. In this small tutorial, we're going to teach you how to create modern looking beds that you've never seen before without using custom content. Yeah, you heard it correctly, with just only a like if you want, you can make cool beds too that are completely usable, so keep watching to learn how. So a little while back, I found a trick that I think it's pretty cool. I'm sure it can be applied to many many things, but yeah. So in the start of the video, I'm going to show you how the trick works and you can apply it to whatever you want or however you want to with different stuff. Um, and then there is going to be, I guess, a speed build that you can either see if you want to download the house and whatnot, the house the room or you can just skip it you know no hard feelings I, I don't care um so yeah stay tuned for that um let's start with the block because well it's not really important and let's get the most basic bed because well we're all about the basics here um let's grab at first light because well you know what we all need lights uh let's Plop one there and one there, that is not correct, that should be here, nope, yep, so that needs to go there, nope, there, yeah, sorry, um, let's grab a bed, oh, also we need the door, of course we need the door, stupid, um, I don't care, let's just grab this door, this is not the point of the tutorial, so, we have the most basic bed that you can actually get. And let me grab me C. Come here, girl. A bit faster. Obviously, she can just sit on it, sleep on it, and do whatever else she wants to. Because, well, it's just a normal bed, right? So, there should, shouldn't be a way that she would not be able to use it. But come on. This bed is... Okay, go away away no no um let's just get her away this board board uh, bed is boring and it is very boring because well in the same set list up to now we don't have that many beds and most of them in this point had become quite boring so let's just say that we want to use this bed because well it has cute beddings um, but you don't like how the bed looks like. So, what can you do? Let me tell you. So, let's go in so all and let's fill the packs. And I'm gonna do that. You can do that with multiple things. But I just love how this thing looks like. Um, so, yeah. I only do it with that because, well, it looks cuter. Um, so you want to get either the clothing hook or the wall light from this paddy. Again, it works with many other things from the debug menu or whatever else you want. But as I said, I just like how these things look. Um, and I usually tend to use this one because let's just say that we want this to be in the same 
size you can see that the light looks a bit better on the same size and that is not a problem like don't you worry that is gonna be fixed so let me tell you what we're gonna do here um, we're going to try at least and create something like I guess a leather type of bed and let me explain okay can you just go there thank you let's grab quite a few of these and we want to go up to there there we go and then we need to do the same thing over this side perfect um but not perfect because that's horrible let's try and fix that no, I don't want to update right now. I'm recording currently, so go away. Um, that will go there. There is a small intersection, but it's all good. I mean, you can barely see it, so again, that's good. Um, and that would go there. Okay. And you can go, obviously, with any color of these you want. I am gonna go with the purest white because I like how the white looks like and you're gonna do the exact same thing over at the sides and you're going to be like yeah sure perfect idea but how the seam is gonna go in the bed well wait um let's just do that oops I did not click try and do that as quickly as possible I'm only obviously going to do it on the one side of the bed because well, there's no way to show you both sides. Um, there. And then obviously those are not correctly lined up and that's frustrating. And something that I've noticed when I was doing that is because there are lights and, you know, everything, um, they snap to the wall. So what you need to do is pretty simple. You just need to get them away. I mean the walls, right, as you saw. Um, so that will go there, and that will go over there, and then that will go over here. So there you have it. Let me just fix them a bit, and I just hurt my hand. Perfect. Um, sadly, we cannot... Come on. I don't remember what I wanted to say. I have no idea. Let me just fix that as quickly as possible. Like that. Because, well, I hate when things are not correctly, ah, correctly lined up. I think it's the most frustrating thing. Um, these type of videos are going to be it and every other Tuesday. I mean, obviously, this is why they're called Tutorial Tuesday. Otherwise, it's not going to be called that. Um, and you can download, when I'm finished, obviously, the rooms on the gallery. You can search the hashtag, I guess. Let's just pop up there. Um, TNT. Which obviously stands for Tutorial Tuesday, or you could just as easily search my username, which is the exact same as here, uh, and they will pop. So I want to use columns, and I think yeah, I want to go there and then there. Do I want these columns? I mean, it's not really important. I just want to show you the trick, right? Um, now that's too big, that would go there and then that would come here and as I said I'm currently only going to do one side of them because there is no point to do both. Um, so girl come here and let's show the people how perfectly this thing works. There you have it, a costume bed that you can just it. and let's be honest doesn't it look way better than the original I think it truly really does 
Um, you can do it with few other stuff that I found that they work, but not with everything. Uh, you need to be careful what you're using. For example, let's see. Let's go on decorations. You can use, obviously, like small plants, but come on, why would you want plants? Um, you can use, what else have I tried it with? Oh, you can use those wood blocks, but well, when they enlarge, they look kind of weird with those things. Uh, you can use the chrome panels, which they look quite good, but they are quite big as well. You have to line up quite a few. And I have another tutorial to show you with this, which I found pretty darn cool. What else can you use? I mean, you can use anything. You can just go in the debug menu and do crazy stuff with them. And I think that is a very neat trick because, as I said, it works, right? And you just that easily transform my bed from a very ugly, I guess, um, looking bed and very cheap and very standard into something very modern. I'm not sure if anyone else has done that. I don't know. I found it myself and I thought it was a very good trick. Like, even with black, it works with any color you might want. It looks very good. I don't know if anyone else has found that before me. I don't know if anyone else has said that. Uh, but as I said, I just found it and I thought it was pretty cool. So, let's just jump right into the speed build and let's just create this room. I will see you in just a bit. Okay, so for the rest of the video, it's going to be a quick, pretty darn quick at least, I think, in my opinion, speed build. Um, room build? Yeah, probably room build. Um, I'm going to make just the bedroom, nothing more, nothing exciting, and it's going to turn out to be pretty darn good, I think. I really like the way it looks like. I did not have something particular in mind. I knew that I just, you know what, want a big nice master bedroom um, for the house to have. And it turns out to be white mostly, like, I don't know, I really like the white because it makes everything look super clean and super nice and it matches with everything. And I also use the Pantone thing, if I'm calling that correctly, colors that they like said those are the colors for the year and stuff. Um, I used those two around just to make it you know more modern like more in and stuff. Um, behind the bed I created a small garden. The thing is because that is shared as one room they don't have a wall. It's not necessary for them to have a wall like it's not something that you really want they can function as normal windows even though they don't have a wall just because i could not share it elsewise i did not put a wall there so that's why you basically will see me not using a wall so i can share it all as one room which i said it's in the gallery and you can easily find it um, the room is pretty big, it turns out to be 9x9 nine nine, and I think it's pretty expensive too. I cannot recall how much it turned out to cost, but it cost quite few simoleons, it's not like super expensive since I did not use, sorry, um, since I did not use such an expensive bed. But yeah, I think it turns out to be around 5,000 simoleons, which again, you know, it's a big room, it's a very modern room and you wouldn't imagine it being like, I don't know. Um, you will see that if you go and download the room, few changes have been made to the room and the reason for that is it did not look good while I tried to like save it on my gallery because we don't have the ability to take our own screenshots i know that there is like an extension that you can take your own screenshots 
but I really don't want to do that because they show up as custom content and they am very much against custom content to be honest like I don't know in the Sims 4 I really loved using them like I used nothing but, but, but custom content but since I started creating and sharing my houses in the Sims 4 I find it quite difficult to give credit to every single uh, person who created the custom content as well as for the people to actually download them um, and I know many people don't use them so I don't use custom content in my game I use mods but not custom content so yeah um, so what I basically changed is I removed those three bamboo plants because they really cut off the view of how the bed was looking like and the screenshots were pretty darn bad and I did not like that. So yeah, basically I changed these with few other bamboo trees. Um, and we're going to dub in the screenshots and I need to thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, you can feel free to leave your suggestions down below for any other future Tutorial Tuesday videos and your comments on how you like this type of video in the room. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you will have an amazing day and take care. Bye! I waved at microphone. Yay, me!